What's happening, Captain? It's Pat the Popper here. Got another pack popping video. Today it's going to be getting into some Ikoria. But to get into those packs of Ikoria, we've got to get into this box of Ikoria. And I got a nice knife here to do so. But before I do that, I'm going to give you a little story. The story is now I got this box of Ikoria. So I went on eBay, I found a nice store on there good seller. I'm not sure if they're getting rid of their inventory. They seem to mostly do um, other trading cards, baseball, you know, basketball cards, football cards, that kind of stuff. You know, they got some other odd items here and there. Now, they've got a really high seller score. They're like 36,000, something like that. So definitely a very trusted, you know, they've got, I think, 300 positive reviews in the last 60 days. So everything seems pretty solid, but it's always worrisome. Uh, top of the box looks pretty good. We got a whole bunch of swoopy lizard wizard logos. It's one of the the big things. There's a lot of fakes going around lately, where they're um, sealing up the boxes again with uh, wraps that you can just buy online. You can just buy this stuff now. So uh, it's kind of sketch that way. But this is pretty nice. There's an actual sticker underneath on the actual box itself. So, I'm pretty sure this guy gets these on dis distribution from a, a solid source. That's uh, what this leads me to believe. I've opened up enough of these to uh, kind of know a little bit here and there. I think this is actually a first print run, if I had to guess. So, I'm definitely excited to get into this. We'll get a couple of packs here. First thing, once I get this open, is I want to go ahead and make sure that the... Uh, box toppers in here that that's sealed that's pretty much going to be the uh dead giveaway if this has been tampered with fucked around if they uh went in scoped anything out that's how we'll know so moment of truth deep breath big money no whammies big money no whammies big money hey we got one right here on top we're not looking like any whammies i definitely feel a card in here now, I've gone through probably nine or ten boxes of Ikoria at this point, so I can tell you this is this is solid. It's still, still on point. Yeah, this is looking good. Put that off to the side. You're not actually going to get to see that open. That right there is pretty much a hit card if you sell it sealed. The reason I do that is it's 20 bucks, $22 I think right now is what they're going for. That's kind of a big part of my game. I like to try and make some money off of doing this stuff. You know, it's fun and everything, but uh, it's also fun to be able to make some money to put it back into it. Now, what I probably will do out of this box, I'm going to keep a decent amount of the triomes in a deck. I'm sleeving, double sleeving, actually. Big ups to uh, Dragon Shield. Getting those from my local gaming store down at the Book Garden, Montpelier, Vermont. Really, really great store. They're helping me out, get a uh, little bit more action in the trading card side of it. So, you'll probably see some of those videos coming up not too long. I'll give you some uh, heads up on the cards I'm giving out and getting back in. One of the things I know kids love down there is uh, trading packs for cards. And once I get into um, that Commander Legends box, I'll hit that Jeweled Lotus, pause off a little bit, trade some of those packs to those guys down there, and uh, get some of their solid rares, mythics, legendaries, and give them some shit packs that probably don't have anything good in it. Big up, Zenikar Rising. You will be missed. You won't be missed. So... Let's start. Our first pack today is going to be out of this uh, Kogla the Titan. Kogla the Ape Titan. In solid, sealed. Nothing seems too janky. We'll go through a couple of packs here. We'll see. Uh, once we get to a couple of good cards, that'll uh, let us know that this is definitely not missed with. That's it's one of the things. It's always kind of sketch. You know, I did get those... Um, Zendikar Rising boxes from a trusted source. Actually got those from Rudy, so big out, big shout out to him. Well, we got a Draineth Magistrate. These are actually really decent in, uh... Ooh, Catbird. That was adorable. I'm interrupting myself because... Oh, look at this fucking adorable Catbird. Meow. Let me get you real close. Oh, you cute little kitty. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. So, back to Draineth Magistrate. So... 
Decent little uh, rare here. Your opponents can't cast spells from anywhere other than their hands. For two, that really locks people out. It's uh, annoying. Super annoying. So, get into another pack here. Gonna be the Prickly Marmo set. So far, I'm feeling really confident about this product. I uh, have been paying a lot of attention to the market side of it and the triumphs just keep creeping up and up and up that's what i was saying about uh bastion right there a little bit of money death's oasis kind of worthless the triumphs keep creeping up creeping up it's going to be quite a while before they reprint them if they do it'll be a couple of years at least two solid years i'd guess and they're just so goddamn useful that um it's hard to pass up on them you know, especially if you're playing Commander, you're pretty much going to... Oh, oh, did you see it? I see the shine. We're getting there. An Ivy Elemental. Dirge Bat. Not too bad. A Foil Brokos. Oh, those eyes on that. Look at that light up. Ah, oh, this looks fucking incredible. I mean, it's not a great card. But, uh, damn looks awesome and we got some more tokens coming up here let's go ahead and get another uh, couple of packs out of this so if you like this kind of content go ahead like subscribe it's super helpful we're actually getting a lot of action now we're getting um more and more subs just past uh is it 33 now i think i saw something like that Hey, God, got me a Luris. Great card right here. I think this is up over $10, $12 at this point. Super, super good card. Sold more than a few of those, and looks like we're going to be selling some more. Not one of my favorite cat tokens, but it's a good token. I, uh, <laughs> it was really fun when I went down for Friday Night Magic. Having all sorts of uh, lands and stuff to give off to people. Seemed like it was uh, the right thing to do. Turn back and grab some of those. Call out for a couple of cards here. We've got a Majestic Arcorn, Mystic Subduel. Savai Thundermane. Another Riel the Everwise. Tranquil Cove. And Straight Up Trash. Let's go ahead and just destroy some stuff. Who doesn't like ripping shit up? So, clear off a little bit there. Let's do one more pack for you. I want to get me a Triome. Maybe, maybe we'll, oh, oh, one of my faves. Maybe we'll keep going until we get to a, a Triome, right? <laughs> maybe we won't. I'm a big fan of these uh, Capture Sphere, the um, Forbidden Friendship, Cathartic Reunion, and Dinosaur Token. It's got all the uh, interactions between this guy and his cute little dino. I don't know why that does something for me, but it does something for me. Also, Migratory Greathorn does something for me. It's probably because they're really good fucking cards. Uh, I'm back for more, and it's a Crystalline Giant. This is an annoyingly good card for how cheap it is. I mean, 3 and 3, and at the beginning of combat on your turn, choose a kind of counter at random that it doesn't already have. From Flying, First Strike, Death Titan... Death Touch, Hexproof, Lifelink, Menace, Reach, Trample, Vigilant, and 1-1. One, one. So, by the end of it, it's going to be, if it is unchecked, it'll end up being a 4-4, four, four, Flying, First Strike, Death Touch, Hexproof, Lifelink, Menace, Reach, Trample, Vigilance. <laughs> that's just, uh, that's fun. What else is fun is these. I, Corey, introduced these little punch cards. They're super helpful. I uh, threw a couple of these in in my uh, dice box. That way, uh, next time I go down when I'm playing against somebody, they're like, I need a first strike counter. Well, buddy, you get a first strike counter. Hey, guys, this has been Pat the Popper. It's been great to have you here. Another pack opening video coming out. We're going to be doing more and more. I'm going to keep changing it up. I'm not going to just bust through with a bunch of these. Like You're going to get a little of this, a little of that, a bunch more of these, a bunch more of that. Stick around. It's been Pat.